This is a tutorial on how to search for duplicate files on your computer and to search for duplicate files I will use total commander this is the program let's press that number to start the program okay and the cursor is not really visible so let's go to configure options and color and inverted cursor okay now the cursor is visible so here's the folder and this one has some images from the windows kit it's uh, they are uh, they are jpeg images and some png files okay and i will copy this folder full of images onto the c drive c drive and let's say into this folder paste get out get into the next folder paste there it is a third one and there it is so these images are copied in three different locations on the C drive and on the C drive Windows is installed so this is a delicate operation I have to be cautious not to delete some system files okay so let's begin go to commands up here in the menu and either use search or search in separate process so I will use this one search in separate process because in that case you can use this search window and you can use the program itself also both of them are available okay so it's searching on the C drive you can see here it's C drive if it's not on the C then search the C drive okay and since we're looking for some duplicate JPEG files we can uh, limit the search by typing uh, star dot JPG if you are not sure what files are you, are you looking for then don't type anything here okay now let's go to advanced so leave, leave this field empty if you're not searching JPEG files go to advanced and you have to click here find duplicate files otherwise it will not search for duplicate files it will su simply search for files okay we can search for duplicate files according to file name that is two files with exactly the same name two files with exactly the same size or two files with the exact same content that will compare the two files or two or more files byte by byte so that's an exact copy or we can have another way the same content and thus the same size but different file name so this one is not checked okay so let's search this way because it's it covers a wider area it, uh, it can have th those files can have uh, different file names even let's start the search okay the program is scanning the entire C drive for files which are sharing the same size and then it will compare them so let's wait until this finishes okay it was compared it found 700 files on the C drive okay so let's maximize this window and let's describe some elements here so we have four buttons down here and if I select any of these files and click view then I can preview that file okay you can do the same thing with another group select it view and there's the file okay another thing new search better don't push this one because it will clear all this search and it will you can start the whole thing from the beginning okay go to file so after you have selected any of these files and press go to file go to file okay then the program locates that ms.jpg ms.jpg it locates it on the hard drive okay you can do the same thing with another file go to file and it's there 
okay so let's get, get back here feed to list box this will feed the entire list this one which is pretty large it will feed to total commander and there you can have multiple options and another thing we have this horizontal lines that horizontal line uh, defines a group so between two horizontal lines we have two files and that means that those two files are exactly the same these two files are exactly the same here in this group these I don't know 10 files or whatever these files are all the same okay so let's feed to list box this entire list and it returns to total commander let's minimize the search window and maximize total commander okay so we can either manually click uh, insert on the keyboard and that will select a file and we can select another file from that group and let's say a third one and so on and with these files uh, selected we can delete those files but be cautious I'm not going to do it because there are in the program files so I'm ruining my own operating system if I delete it okay so let's go to mark and unselect all okay so you can delete it manually but you can go to mark and select group or just hit the numeric plus key on the keyboard okay and if you don't select anything just press ok then the program selects from each group every file except the newest one so that's exactly the first one but that's not the case for each and every group that's a huge group okay th there's the newest one that's black and that's not selected so each and every red file can be deleted because it's already selected but I'm not going to delete it because it's on my Windows uh, partition so I'm unselecting everything let's go back to mark and use select group again and this time I'm going to go to select by folder okay here are the folders all of them are selected click none to deselect them and since I copied a folder called test into three locations and here it is one then I should select only those folders which contain the test subfolder so I have three subfolders and that's it okay so the program selected each of those JPEG files which are situated in my test folders so each of and every file it's located in a test folder these are not selected because there's no test subfolder there okay that's it only here at the end okay so I will really delete those files there are JPEG files you can see there there are JPEGs delete and yes this deletes to the recycle bin so it's safe you can undo it if you don't like it okay let's get out from this by pressing these two buttons one of them okay let's get back into the first folder and there's my the test folder which I copied and there are PNG files there and that's because I have selected only JPEG files so let's get out from this and return to commands and search in separate process and this time I will not select uh, JPEG but PNG okay I have to go to advanced and duplicate files select that one and check the file name and instead check the content and search now it's searching on the hard drive once again but this time only for png extension files and those files will be 
with the same content and that's the same size it's comparing them and voila let's feed it to the list box again okay let's do the same mark select group and only those no, no, only those which are in the test folder this this and another one test 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 here it is this one oops so you don't have to keep uh, pressing control here just use the mouse click 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 and you can select uh, multiple folders and click OK and there are those three images the list is huge there are many PNG files on this partition and that's it I think oh here are some more okay the, those are in the test folder and they are PNG and I can delete them okay get out to the root directory props okay the folder remains there but it's totally empty let's get into the second folder the test folder is there but it's empty and program data test folder is there but it's empty okay so I just deleted my duplicate files from the C drive using total commander okay that was a long tutorial but thanks for watching and have a good day bye bye